welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm showing you how to do my hashtag faux liner. I've been doing the faux winged liner for the longest time, but I never had a name for it. And then I came up with a name for it, and I was like, oh my god, that is perfect, because that's exactly what it is. This liner looks like I'm wearing a winged liner, doesn't it? But this is actually just eyeshadow. This is my faux winged liner, and I wanted to show you guys how to do it in depth. It is the easiest damn thing in the world. Anybody can do it. You don't have to be talented. You don't have to have like a non-shaky hand. You don't have to spend five hours trying to get your winged liner perfect. This can be done in literally two seconds flat. It looks exactly the same as winged liner, but we're actually not using liquid liner or eyeliner at all. We're using eyeshadow. The faux winged liner is perfect for anybody. It'll suit any eye shape there is. When I used to work as a makeup artist on counter, I worked for Chanel. I used to do clients all the time. I was their resident makeup artist and I used to get a lot of mature clients. So I would always do the faux winged liner on them. It'll suit any eye shape, suits any age, suits hooded eyes. It's just the best technique in the world. So I'm gonna get into the video now and show you how to create the faux liner. So what you'll need is some sticky tape. Doesn't really matter what sticky tape you use. I got this one off Amazon or eBay years ago and I really can't remember what it is, but I know that it's not particularly sticky, so it's not difficult to get off. It could be surgical tape. You will also need a brush. It honestly doesn't matter what brush you use at all. I personally prefer to use one of these three brushes. The one on the left is a Sigma E20, the one in the middle is a Sigma E55, and the little one on the right is a Sigma E21. You can use any brush you like it doesn't matter. Then you're gonna need an eyeshadow. It doesn't matter what color you use. That's completely up to you and it depends on what color you want your faux winged liner to be. I'm gonna go with black today. So what you're gonna do first of all is take some of the sticky tape and an easy rule of thumb to remember because a lot of times people get confused as to how angled they should make it or if they should make it more straight. What I like to do is just kind of roughly line it up from the corner of my eye to the top of my ear. This part here, not this part that one. And that should give you a pretty good estimate as for how angled to make it. For my faux winged liner today, I'm going to use a Sigma E20 brush because it gives it a nice smoky look. So pat your brush in your eyeshadow, look at what you're doing, and then just start to pat it along your lash line. Obviously how thick or how thin you want your faux liner is completely up to you and depends on your eye shape. Then what I'm going to do for the inner corner of my eye is switch to the smaller E21 brush so that I have more control. Then if you want your faux liner really black and really pigmented like a real winged liner, just take some water or some setting spray, spray it on your brush. Then put your brush in the black and start patting on your eyelid. I personally like my faux wing a little bit smoky, especially at the top edge. So once I've got my faux liner in place, I just go back with my brush and kind of smoke out the edges a little bit. I just think it looks nice, but you don't have to do that. You can keep it completely neat if you want to. Okay, so this is one faux liner on this eye, and I've done the other faux liner on this eye. Then all you do is carefully and gently peel your sticky tape off, because obviously you don't want to give yourself wrinkles. And there you go. Super clean, super neat faux winged liner, and you can make it any damn shape you want. So I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of my eye makeup and my face makeup, and I will come back and show you what the faux liner looks like when everything else is on. My makeup is done! Yes. So this is what the faux winged liner looks like when the rest of the makeup is on. As you can see, the faux winged liner looks amazing, but it's so easy to do. I think that a three-year-old could literally do this. It's so easy. You can do it with any brush that you have. You can do it with any sticky tape that you have. You can do it with any eyeshadow that you have. It doesn't matter. You don't have to spend money on expensive winged liners. You don't have to be talented. Trust me, guys, the faux winged liner is the way to go. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did enjoy this video, can I pretty please have a thumbs up? Because then I know that you liked it. So I'll film more videos like this for you and I'll come up with more hacks and I'll find easier ways to do makeup. So let me know if you liked it by giving me this. Give me this. If you do try out my faux winged liner, make sure to put a picture up on Instagram and use the hashtag 
faux liner because I'm gonna be stalking that hashtag when this video goes live and leaving love on anybody that hashtags that hashtag and tries out my technique. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, just press that little subscribe button underneath this video and click the notification bell next to it as well if you wanna be notified when my videos go live. It probably won't happen because YouTube's broken, but hey, we could try. I upload four times a week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I love your guts and I will see you on Monday night for a brand new video. Bye!